What's up, YouTubers? Welcome back to Let's Play The Legend of Zelda The Wind Waker HD for the Wii U, originally on the GameCube. I'm Ryan Hanson 1, let's get started. In the last episode, we stole some bombs from Tetra because we need him to get to Jaboon, who has the next pearl. So we'll be visiting him in this episode. And... Aww. Are you ready? If that is the case, we must search the cave around the back of the uh, outset where Jaboon is set, said to hide. So, um, uh, like I said, I'm gonna need some rupees for the auction house later. I don't think I'll be doing it in this episode, but still, I want to be picking up some treasure. So, I'll be picking up a lot of treasure this episode, hopefully. And what's inside? What's inside? I think I know what's inside, but I'm keeping the suspense anyway. No, you gotta, you got 50 rupees. All right. All right. So, down here to the back, and here you see this little whirlpool here. Well, oh, you're going so slow. I wish I had a swift sail right now. Oh no, we're being sucked in. Well, here's Javin's place, so let's shoot it with the cannon. So, I'm, uh... Oh, if I can actually aim. So... Come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go. So, now only one left. And there we go! Wow, that wasn't too hard. If the whirlpool sucks you up, you'll end up some random spot on the map. I'm not even sure if you take damage, but if you do, you don't take that much. Anyway, we will go see Jaboon. And yeah. Oh, Ocarina of Time music, Jabu Jabu's Valley. Which I think Jaboon might be a descendant of Jabu Jabu. Now, I actually have the translation to it for this Hylian this time. Well met, King of Red Lions. Well met indeed, Jaboon. I am pleased to see that you are safe. The events which we have long feared seem to have been set into motion. Yes, it is, seems that Ganon has returned. There has been no other explanation. If you sought me out... It must mean you have found the hero of time, does it not? Unfortunately, that is not so. Then for what purpose have you come to see me? The one I have brought with me has no connection to the legendary one. And yet, I sense a great promise in the courage that this one possesses. Promise? You suggest that I leave the fate of Hyrule up to mere chance? I do. It is the only way. I see. Then I suppose it is up to the gods to deem whether his courage is true. I give you the guidepost to the gods. Yep, no dungeon. We just get Nehru's Pearl right here. You got Nehru's Pearl. The water spirit Jabun was kind enough to give you this jewel, treasure of one of the goddesses. This jewel should dispel the curse that Ganon has cast upon this land. So, foul rain and endless night were indeed elements of a curse brought on us by Ganon. Uh, he must intend to cast this land in pure darkness for all time. Tell me, King of Red Lions, have you learned the whereabouts of the one who carries the bloodline of the Princess Zelda? I believe I have. That is well. You must protect Zelda. She cannot be permitted to fall into the hands of Ganon. I am counting on you.
Ganon's curse has been broken by the power of the pearl that Jaboon gave us, so morning should come soon. It is well that we gathered all the pearls. Are you ready, Link? I've marked the places where you must set the pearls on your sea chart. Uh, once you have placed uh, each of the pearls in, in its proper location, the proving grounds for your courage will become apparent. Clearly, the search for Jaboon has shown that Ganon has begun to make efforts to block our path forward. It is certain that the pearls will be ahead greater than anything we face uh, thus far. Alright. So, it is now marked on our map. We're going to do a lot of sailing this episode, so I think I'm going to speed up the footage, and when we get to an island, then I will stop speeding up the footage. And I think we're going to do a lot of side questing as well. So, I will see you guys on square C5. All right, I think we're at the destination we need to be at, so, um, uh, yeah, um, uh, tingle bottle, nothing that worth mentioning, but now, see this place right here? Well... Check this out, there's cannons here. So we need to blast them down. And I'm not close enough, am I? Alright. Now I think I'm close enough. So let's shoot the one covering the ladder. And I think I can take out the rest from up there. So, what do you say we climb the ladder? So, once again, bombs away! So, climbing the ladder, climb the ladder, climb the ladder, climb the ladder. I'm gonna ruin the peaceful music with enemy music. Because <clears throat> I am willing to destroy these guys and show no mercy. And open this... Ch I said open this... Open this chest! And we get a red rupee. Now, you, uh, once you defeat the Bacoblins, you might want to take out all the cannons. And hopefully I can get some more bombs, because I will need some. Uh, does this game know what I need? There we go. Uh, yeah, I'm a O cannon right here. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. All right, bomb here. <clears throat> Okay, I'm, uh... No, nothing important. Alright. I think these are the last two. Uh, 
All right, now that we've bombed all the cannons, a chest will appear. And what's inside this chest, you may ask? Well, you got a piece of heart. Yeah, I actually did it this time. I hummed along, or said words along to the theme. I mean, you remember the conversation mess-ups episode, right? So anyway, um, uh, I think I'm gonna sail one square west to D7. Or not, it west, east. East to D7. Alright, here I am, and we have some annoying enemies called Sea Hats, so they're like a much worse version of P Hats. Anyway, what do you say we mark this place on our map? Okay. Holy small fry! Yeah, yeah, I've heard. I take you want to chart an information about this island. Uh, then start by opening your seed charts. Southern Triangle Island. I mean, I just marked this place just because, you know, found the map at least a little bit, so it's easier to see where I'm going. So anyway, yeah, and, uh, yeah, I really don't need his information. I think I'll know enough about this game. Okay, I hate sea hats. I hate sea hats. All right, Tingle Bottle. Okay, I'm just, I'm just really picking up tingle bottles that don't make any sense. But Nehru's Pearl? Wandering traveler who speaks the guidepost of the goddesses. Place the pearl you hold here. So place Nehru's Pearl, the one we just got. Ooh, glowing in the dark. That's so cool! Place Nehru's Pearl in the ancient statue's hands. Two pearls remain. Now I will, s or just a sec. All right, I will continue sailing east, and I will meet you guys at square F7, or not F7, F5. All right, here we are. So, um, I want to talk to the map fish real quick so we can get this place marked. I mean, I kind of just want to fill up my map, so... So, um, uh... Eat the bait! All right. Holy oh, small fry. Yeah, yeah, I've heard. Yeah, so let's open up our seed chart. Whoop. 
Bomb Island. Well, uh, one square north of the Forest Haven. Yeah. Okay, that was not really that useful. Or was it? I don't know. I'm not in this Let's Play to talk to fish and hear their info. I talk to fish to get their stuff marked on my map. Um, uh... So, Bomb Island. This is probably one of my favorite islands. It's just so cool, and... So, what we want to do is... Let's see if I can get some bombs. I mean, this is called Bomb Island. Bombs? Rope? Bombs? It's yours, my friend. As long as you have enough rubies. Okay, I just can resist. No bombs? Really? 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 I don't even think I did the voice right for the Zelda CDI reference. Down the hole we go. Oh yeah, this place is just so cool. And guess what? We have whatever these things are called. I don't remember. Like, I, I think I remembered looking up once when I was looking up the name for Morths, and I think I saw the, these guys' names, but I don't remember what it is. Uh, I don't know. May, I think it began with an M or something. I don't know. But anyway, basic puzzle solving is basic. Now, let's see if we can get any hearts or bombs. Alright, thank you for the bombs. Thank you so much. Alright, yeah, you want to be careful in there. Because you will obviously take damage if you touch the lava. And I think I've... May have, sh may or may not have shown that off in Dragon Roost Cavern. I really don't remember. All right. Oh no, one of these guys. I mean, these guys are just so annoying, aren't they? I mean, I always have a rough time with them on that one room in Dragon Roost Cavern when you gotta, you know, throw the water, but these guys get in your way. So anyway, there's two switches you want to get held down. So, but since they're covered in fire, since they're covered in fire, yeah, you really have to throw these guys in. All right, so I'm um, heart throw. So now that the fire is uncovered on the treasure chest, what's inside? You got a piece of heart! Alright. So now, we will not be careful at all and just rush back. And I do not know how the pots respawn when we never even left the room. Oh, wait. Did... Um, uh... Did it... Did I break the pots before I touched the lava? I might have respawned that way. Um, uh... Alright, now there's one more heart piece I want to collect in this episode, and I think we'll be good. Ho ho ho! To think that over there, there will be such a container. I think he's referring to the empty bottle we got, um, uh, quite a few episodes ago. So, I will meet you guys at square G7.
All right, and I'm back. Uh, I think we want to go over here because I'm looking for a submarine on this island. Oh, uh, yep, there it is. Man, I'm just running out of things to say. So. So, yeah, we're gonna find a piece of heart in here. I already let you know that earlier. But how will we get it? Oh, you know, just a short enemy gauntlet. So, let's defeat this Bacabon. Oh no, he's so much scarier because he has a flaming stick. Alright, Zybacop. Alright. Uh, am I saying alright a lot? I really don't know. And I want those rupees. Just die. And voila. A ladder is created. Check it out! Yeah! So we now have eight heart containers. That's really good. Oh no. Okay, I don't think you have to defeat the keys then. But you know what? They're annoying. So kill them if you want. I actually think that's gonna do that's gonna be good for this episode so we will uh, venture forth in the next episode so if you enjoyed this video feel free to give it a thumbs up don't forget to comment below and subscribe if you haven't already next time on the legends of the wind waker hd we will continue sailing and uh hopefully get all the pearls in and i think i might stop by windfall island and do the auction house and get the swift sale so until then, I've been Ryan Hanson 1. See you guys next time. Bye.